Breaking right now at 5 o'clock, a violent start to the long holiday weekend. CMPD investigating another homicide here in the Queen City. Police found a woman dead inside a car. This was in North Charlotte on Oakwands Court this morning. The This, by the way, Charlotte's 60th murder of 2019 compared to 58 of all of last year. NBC Charlotte's Alex Shabab following the latest developments tonight. Alex, do we know how the victim was killed? Well, there are still a lot of questions. Police have not said who the victim is or how she was killed. And tonight, neighbors are trying to figure that out, too. Because of this massive police presence, three teenage sisters are second guessing. It's scary and terrifying. What they thought they heard this July 4th morning. And I heard back to back shots, but it's, I thought it was fireworks. I thought it was just people playing around with fireworks because it's the fourth. And now, like, every time somebody do fireworks, I'm going to think it's gunshot. Officers responded just down the road on Oakwinds Drive to a call for an assault with a deadly weapon. At around 8.30 this morning, police found a woman dead in a car. But at this point, they have not said how she was killed. There's signs of an injury and some blood. That's all I know at this point. We're certainly treating it as a homicide. It's definitely a suspicious death at this point that we're investigating. It's Charlotte's 60th homicide this year compared to 58 murders in all of last year. I've never been up close to an actual crime scene for like feet away from me, so it kind of like shocked me. So I'm thinking, okay, this is a good neighborhood, so nothing won't happen, but then I turn around and I look, I'm like, I uh, kind of got to watch what I do and where I go. A day meant to celebrate the country's independence, now taking a tragic turn for the Queen City and for the victim's family. I'm kind of glad it wasn't one of my family members, but I'm also feel bad for the other family because they lost a loved one on the 4th. At this point, we don't have any information about a potential suspect. It is an active and ongoing investigation. In Charlotte, Alex Shabad, NBC Charlotte.